Bienvenidos, welcome. As always, let's start by welcoming all the new subscribers to the Boncha Crew. Welcome to the Boncha Crew. If you have not yet subscribed, go ahead and do me a favor right now. Yep, go to the right. Hit that bell so you're notified every time that I post and every time that I go live. I am at one of my favorite Mexican restaurants here. This is in South Phoenix, Arizona. It's called Bonchos. I haven't been here in like two years because they had shut down the dining due to the whole outside that was going on. They uh, recently remodeled and opened you know, it back up. Uh, the only thing though is there's a line to China and it opens at 4 p.m. which is a little bit odd but I'm here I made it I waited in the line it's such an ambience in here you guys so again if you're from South Phoenix go ahead and comment in the comments below but this is deliciousness at its best so you guys know I got to start off with the salsa here goes the salsa right here the salsa to me is more of a tomato base it does have a little bit of a spice um, 1 to 10 I would say the spice is like mm, Maybe like a three. For those that don't like spices, it's probably gonna be a ten for you. But no, I mean, let, let's go ahead. I've been here before, so this right here is gonna just it's gonna initiate every taste bud on my tongue and all over. Mmm. Again, this is more giving me. Um, I could taste a little bit of cilantro, but it's more of a, of a tomato sauce. Um, I can taste a little bit of the spice from the pepper. Mm -hmm. And I do have Ariel here, and she is not on today, you guys. I know you guys are going to be like, where's Ariel? But we have a little special guest as well with us, so she has to attend to our little special guest, Jack. But this place brings back so much memories, let me tell you. It was, whew, it was a hot summer. <laughs> And shout out to all my friends from South Phoenix, Arizona. But this place right here, this just takes me back to my childhood. Yes, being over here, you know, being at, uh-huh, what I should been is at home, studying or going to church. But I used to come out here with you guys a lot during my party days and like party scene days. And yes, yes, I was a big time partier. Had a party crew and everything. I don't know, um, back in the days, a uh, party crew was more like a group of girls and we would legit just all, you know, get all dolled up and, you know, ready for the night and go and hit up some backyard parties and, you know, sneak into some clubs at the same time. And let me tell you though, my party crew ran the streets though. I'm not gonna say it on here because I don't want people to, you know, you know, you know, but either way, you guys, it's just, brought me back to those those childhood memories i miss being a teenager you know i miss those days it was so fun to be free and you know not have no bills or you didn't have no worries in the world you guys right if you had a, a crazy party life back in your time comment that below what was your nickname well i'll tell you my nickname though my nickname was lady suavecita mm, yes <laughs> shout out to all my girls from the pocket crew back in the day. But yeah, it was fun, you know. It's just being free, you know, being young, being, you know, young and dumb. But yeah, I had a lot of my moments. All right, so I placed my order. I went with the president's choice. It's called La Chiquitita, you know, for La Chiquitita nuts. <laughs> it's a little bit of everything. I actually like that because it's like a sampler of everything. I mean, it comes with the chimichangas, the tostadas, it comes with tacos, it comes with tamales. I mean, it's kind of just like being able to taste everything. But Ariel got, what did you get? Well, you guys are gonna have to stay tuned. I got a little bit of everything. I got, um, Chile Vano. Chile Vano, what you already know, she got that's a must. A tamale and enchilada. That you already know that's Ariel's favorite. If she's looking at the menu, that's exactly what she's gonna order. But um, yeah, I was just saying this place brings back so much memories of my party scene days, funny memories too. Like, I used to, man, I used to always be in those backyard parties and stuff. And when I say a backyard party, some are going to be like, what's a backyard party? What it is, is someone's tío, tía, mom or dad would, excuse me, would allow us to host a party in the backyard. So we would, you know, and you know, go in and do a big old shout out of, you know, this is going to be a party and this and that. And you know, we had a good time. I don't need all you Debbie Downers. You'd be like, oh, you were too young. Worry about yourself because I was young and having fun. 
sorry you didn't but yeah it was fun i um like my party crew would always have like our color of our party crew was yellow and um we had like a certain symbol that we were known for and and you know it was it was just being in the moment you know being free and, and not having no bills like i will ever cherish those memories shout out to all my girls again those are forever memories that i forever cherish i wish i could go back because you already know this mama now by yeah by last 8 30 around 8 30 i'm already falling asleep i can't even stay up late so um i'm excited though because again i haven't been here in two years and this is up there so when people ask what is that this is up there for me um this is the one right here this is the one out of the three. I don't want to always just put one. I got three favorites, but this is one of the three. It's, it's, I mean, it's worth it. I mean, it opens at four, which it, back in the day used to be open pretty much like all day, but it's nice in here. I love the new look. It's cute. I love, I mean, the air, it's, it's you know, cold. For Ariel, she's probably over here like, I'm cold. For me, that's perfect, because I'm a polar bear. <laughs> But um, if you, you know, if you're from South Phoenix, comment below. Let me know what you recommend. I and you can hear a little special guest here over here saying hi to everybody. <laughs> but you guys stay tuned because I'm gonna wait for the food. All right, la comida llegó. The food has arrived. So let me go over what is it that I ordered. I got the President's Choice, which Bill Clinton, I believe, did come here as well. Because I know we, I went to, is it Menanito? I could never pronounce that place for the love of me in Tucson. I know he went there, but when he was here, he came to South Phoenix. So I got his plate, and this plate right here is a little sample of everything. There's chimichangas, there's tostadas, tacos. They even got some other burritos in here, enchiladas. Uh, no, hello, I wish hello. they had enchiladas. Let me take that back. They have um, tamales. I got the green corn tamales. And then Ariel over here. Let me show you what it is. She got here. Ariel got the number eight, right? She got the number eight, which is a chile relleno, a green corn tamale, and a green cheese enchilada. And a green cheese enchilada, rice and beans. You guys, let's go ahead. Let's get in. I'm hungry. Tengo hambre. If you can join us for our prayer. Dear Lord, Heavenly Father, thank you for the blessing of this meal. May you bless someone else for me. Dear Lord, may this meal be nutrition to our bodies, dear Lord. Thank you for the blessing. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. Ooh, I'm hungry. I think, you know, oh, I forgot to say amen, amen, amen. And put it in the comments. Shame on me. I'm just, I'm excited. Let's get in because I'm hungry. I'm going to start off with this little, little, look at la chiquitita. That's the name of this plate. Look at this little, little taquito. Look how tiny that is. Mm. All right, so let me go ahead and take a bite. Y'all, live through me because this is so delicious here. Mm. And inside it has a cheese, it has a shredded beef. Oh my goodness. Uh -uh. I don't know if I have it. When I go to places, I love to try a little bit of everything. So, if any of you guys come out here, I recommend you get this. And it's called La Chiquita. You know, because I'm Chiquita. But I asked for extra cheese in my beans because I love me some cheesy beans. Mm. Mm. Oh my goodness, look at that cheese right there. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> I can already hear those that are Mexican saying you're gonna be tapada. Which you know if you're meant to be what that means, but because you know how they say with cheese what it does to you. I don't care. Mm. Their beans are to die for. Those are so good. Oh my, they're creamy. Mm. You know these are made with lard though. That is the way it used to be. My baby over here, she she joining us. I went to get this little tostada. Look at how cute this little tostada. But here's my hand. Look at how cute that is. But you know, I'm gonna put some of the salsa on here. Mm. I love me some tostada. 
Has anyone had tostadas with, it's called pinga? Mm. It's like shredded chicken with like a chipotle flavored. Um, I'm, I'm make it with like chipotle and then I add a little bit of crema. Mm. I'm so happy that they have opened up again the dining. Mm -mm. Yeah, they were closed for about. They've been. Well, they have. Um, if you don't want to dine in, you can order. They have a two bar, a pickup and two go area. But they recently opened up the dining. Mm -mm. Because I'm so excited, I forgot. I finally got my peel box. Can you believe that? I went through the hardest time in the day. Like they were over there saying that. Oh, and I got me a sprite back here as you can see. They were over there saying I went to some peel box in North Phoenix. They're being extra. He's like, no, you cannot use Diane Puro one I'm like, no, that's a privacy thing for privacy. I'm gonna give you my legal name, but I want an alias, you know, an AKA. He was talking about I need an LLC and stuff on my girl by. So I went to another different location and I was able to get a peel box. I'm gonna put that peel box right now. So everyone that was asking for my peel box address, there you go, you guys. And only because you guys asked, I got that peel box. Baby, how are you liking your food? Arrow's real fine over here. Yes. Don't worry, y'all. Okay. I'm getting you close. That went number four. <laughs> Look at you. Mm. 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 The beans. Mm. The beans are uh, probably the best beans I've ever had. No, it could be bread. Sure. Go ahead and make it with you. Mm -hmm. Take your bread. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. mm -hmm. I got me a green, a green for tamale too, right here. Mm -hmm. And it has the green, the green chili in here. Mm -hmm. I love the green tamales. Are you a red tamale or a green? Okay. This is green corn. It is so good. Okay, that's it. Mm. 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 If you've been here, comment down below. If you haven't been here and you're in Phoenix, I highly recommend. And this is this plate right here is two. So there's two tostadas, two tamales, two mini chimichangas, and then I chose beans because you know I really don't cut the rice too much. But as Ariel said. These beans are something else. Mm -mm -mm. I'm up to eat all this cheese right now. I'm not gonna be tapada all day. Cheers. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness. How many of you have a bite I got a baby. I got two of them. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I got two of them. That's how I was telling them that it comes with, it's best when it comes with two. I got two corn. Uh, Two green corn from my house. Mm -hmm. So now I'm gonna try over here. That's our little friend right there. He's all excited too. So I'm gonna try you guys the hold on real quick. Mm, I'm gonna get messy right here. Here we go. This is the um, mini chimichanga. Oh. Mm. Mm. Mm -mm. It is so good. Oh my goodness. It's just so good inside. It has the shredded beef and then it's with the red sauce. It's a mini chimichanga. Oh my gosh, it's so delicious. That is so good. You want to try one, baby? Yeah, I'm going to have to, yeah. Mm. That is so good. Three, two. And look at the little taquitos there. These are so cute. Mm. These are so cute. Mm -mm. 
Remember, if it's not on your face, it doesn't belong in your plate. Mm. Rambo's over here in heaven. Yeah. And our little guest, he is Liddy. Making mm -hmm. I must say why I like this place is because I feel that every plate is just, like, just specially made for you. And just the quality and the taste of everything, oh my goodness. See, baby, look at that right there. This thing right here, right here, this big old thing, that's a tamale. Look at that. Mm. Mm. Take a bite, look at that. I am team green. Love green salsa, love green sauce, green tamales. Mm. Look at that, that's somewhere. Did I? I'm so sorry. I had to get some of my microphone. I had my uh, wireless one, but I forgot it in my car. Um, before we came in here, so I'm like, this is gonna have to work. But the spice level in the green tamale, I would say, is very minimal. Because mm -mm. I've had some spicy green tamales. I do also like when I come in their boiled fundillo. I mean, boiled fundido. <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness, y'all about to come for me. Do not come for me. That is. <laughs> oh my goodness. I don't like to pronounce that because I always mess up on it. And it's so embarrassing. One time I ordered it, I'm like, can I have a boil from Bio? She's like, Okay. I'm like, oh, never mind. And those that don't speak Spanish, that's from Bio is your. I can't. It is so worth it in here though. I love this place. I don't know because they remodel. I'm curious to know if there's a room back here where Bill Clinton had set where he sat and they have like you know had like a mural um in other words by that table where he sat. I'll have to check it out to see if you know if it's still there. Mm. I'm a big I'm, I'm a big fan of like little mini like for example like when you go into a party and they have like a platter I love like the little mini chimneys like these are, this right here is perfect you know because in all reality you get to taste everything for me oh but this right here this is something else look at that mm. oh my friend you want to try it I'm gonna have my boots right. Let her go sit real quick. She got this. Oh, oh she get, She needs a, the toppings. Yeah. She's trying to give it to me. All same. <laughs> I can't. Look. She ain't got no lemon. Cause I know they're like, where's the lemon at? But I like that it's in the red sauce. Mm -hmm. I love that. That. It's pretty much like um. Like a smothered mini chimichanga. When I say smothered, you know, the tortilla is like, it's like, you know, where they, um, mm, is it good? The tortillas were basically they um, get it drenched in that red sauce, but inside is red. Look at it. Mm, that's red chili inside. Mm -mm. Mm. Oh my goodness. If you can taste how delicious I am a big fan of the red chili. The red chili is so good here. We were reading outside while we were waiting to come in that this business started off with a red and green chili. They were really well known for that. Then they expanded their menu. Mm -hmm. Let me tell you, their red chili is just something else. Mm. Mm -mm. This is so bomb. Oh my goodness. Their beans? They make it different. 
Says muchas gracias, and I will see you guys on the next live or the next vlog. Adios. Adios. Adios.